Hey what's up guys, I'm Fiji and welcome to Life is Strange. Now, when the release trailer came out for this game, there was a lot of, should I say, mixed opinions, fairly harsh opinions on this game, as it seemed very stereotypical the game, it was it seemed like one of those corny team movies put into a game. But as the game came out, reviews skyrocketed for this game and exceed everyone's expectations. It's another, should we say, uh, Telltale Games-esque kind of game with the whole story-driven kind of aspect to it, with the whole choosing your own options, that kind of thing. So, it may seem like kind of game. It is, but it's not my by Telltale Games and that would, that would really got me interested in this game because we all know what you, I think you all know I love Telltale games. They make some amazing games like both seasons with The Walking Dead, The Wolf Among Us, and they're currently they're doing Game of Thrones and Tales of the Borderlands. So it, it, it's not obviously made by them, but and I can't really I shouldn't really mention them, but screw it. It's a, it's one of those kind of games that you can you can compare it to them. And I'm talking am I ass again? But in other fact, just continue as I, I need to test the audio when I first start this game up and I think I just need to decrease it by just once more oh, no, I need to get the subtitles on I, just, I need to be sure just to make sure obviously the game volume isn't too high in that but in order to continue I literally did like 10 seconds of the game literally 10-15 seconds just to test the audio out so please ignore that guys don't worry I have not played any of this game yet and I cannot wait to play it so let's go and I love the music, and we all know I love music in games, etc. That still scared me. That 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 scared the shit out of me, guys. That lightning did when I first started the game up, and it still made me jump, man. Hey, bloody hell! But volume it should be perfectly fine now. Audio, everything. My I shouldn't be too loud for you to hear. The game volume, the game volume shouldn't be too loud, so you can't hear me. So. This is the, it's, it's the, the problem I always seem to have when I start recording a new series. I always have to try it all out and that. I need to start using Audacity. All that. I'll shut up now because this is the intro. How did I get here? And where is here? I always love the art style in these games. I'm glad. No, okay, um, I'll shut up a minute. Please let me make it there. Okay, fine. As I was just saying, um, I really, I love the art style in these games. Yeah, I feel like if they wanted, they literally could like go all out in in terms of graphics, like you know, make it proper realistic and that. But I've always liked these art styles, especially in the in the um, in Telltale games that they make. So I'm glad they've kept to that kind of art style in this. It, it, this is actually published by um, Square Enix and they made some really good games, obviously like Final Fantasy and that. So I'm I'm looking forward to this and we'll say, uh, uh, what's this? Okay. Holy shit, that storm! Oh my god! <laughs> uh, where are we going? Oh, okay. Holy shit! You only just saw that. Oh, no, never mind, never mind. Oh, I'm so excited. Cause you know, you guys know I'm a sucker for these kind of games. And I feel like it's been kind of like... Oh shit. Yeah, of course it was all a dream. That was so surreal. So surreal. Little pieces of time. But it could be you know, you guys know I'm a sucker for these kind of games. I feel like it's been a part of my channel now. And these kind of games just seem to always pop around for me to play, which is great. To shadow, from color to curiosity. Well, I think yes, I knew I knew she was going to be the bitch of the series. Can you give me an example of a who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless Look. faces. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Oh, so we're in like a photography class, I'm guessing. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw uh. humanity as tortured, right? 
Look at this crap. Oh, no. Thank How you. can I show that. this to Mr. Jefferson? Uh, it's a good I journalism. haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. I, if I shouldn't be reading this, but screw it. What would they think? Uh, you know what? I'm sorry, guys. I can't read all that bloody hell. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. Okay, it's so like a little hunk of thing, and I'm guessing. Moment of desperation. Yeah, it's like a pencil case. And so I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. <laughs> But so, this is so stereotypical already, I've got to admit. Chose to capture people at the I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. Mm, I'm going to take a selfie. She do. Don't mind me, I'm just going to take a selfie. I do love no, my no, analog no, camera. Boy. I'm not a big fan I should take a quick picture now. I prefer Can you just bear with me a second? Fred. I need to take a selfie. Me too, Victoria. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful oh, photographic shit. tradition. Um, it's all right. And Max has a gift. Oh. Of course, as you all Banks. know, the photo portrait so has been Max popular then. since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for no shit food. selfie expression. The girl, for Christ's sake, it's gonna be from Maxine. I couldn't resist. <laughs> the point remains that the Man, you look fabulous for a teacher. Been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Full of her like kids just said, just sitting there like, since yeah, I've had shit. interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please... Tell us the name of the process oh that gave birth um, to the first um, self-portraits. Um, um, uh, you're asking me? You're asking me? Um, L let me think. Um, you either know this or not, Max. I'm sorry. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Let me guess you, Louis yeah. Louis Daguerre was a yeah. French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Who the hell says sad Very face? Story. The Daguerrean Fuck process you. brought out fine details. Like another selfie. Faces, making no. them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first I American Daguerreotype self-portrait I, can't, I, I don't want to listen to this shit. You know, I actually I watch it one part. I was interested in going to photography. In your textbook. I kind of like shine a light from it. Online. Oh, school bell. And guys, don't School's forget out. the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, there's always that one girl that you look fucking. Don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. Okay, I think nice. both those two girls that just, that just showed up are going to be the bitches. Anyone wants me to stay? Oh, bloody hell. So she doesn't like. She doesn't like. I mean, I'm guessing she likes photography, but she's not proud of it. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Just ignore him, Max. They're not of worth course. it. Of course, Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, you know most what? expensive, everything. Fuck you, Victoria. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Bloody hell. Okay. Uh, can I talk to other people? Hello, Kate. How are you doing? Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. What's this here? Uh, Looks like somebody was already working on this. That's cool. pretty cool. Uh, let's talk to her. She seems upset. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. God, you look freaking tired, don't you? Uh, I don't need to marry you. Kate, I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. Yeah. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me She's too. She's got nothing on me, same so I'll get. Sure. Okay, um, anyone else? Or... Oh god, you're being a kiss up to the teacher now, are you? Freaking bitch. Oh, okay, I didn't mean, I didn't... Okay, screw it. <laughs> I'll take a picture, because I can. Dead ass. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Man, you, you're a bit paranoid, aren't you? This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Oh, do you like him? Let's have a look at this. Even in pictures, the I always, I always like always to have a good look mysterious. around in these kind of environments. Just to have a good feel we for the game. never escape the lighthouse here. Oh, that was in the dream? Okay. That's, in that's interesting. Yeah, let's do it, let's do it Mr. Jefferson, then. Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Sure. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Um, I didn't have any time. I didn't have any time. 
Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Man, that lip syncing All you need is next gen. is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. I don't know what's got what she's doing with her hair here, but screw it. It's typical American stuff. Sorry, I didn't mean to sound very stereotypical. Um, I don't even know what the word is for it now. Man, but, he yeah. even has the best plasma HTTV you know I mean? class. I, mean, I didn't mean to sound like. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries <laughs> on this say. bad boy. So cool that we more can books. check these out any time. The books. decisive moment by Henry Cartier Bresson. That's rare. She's and into Lee books. Bits. Mad respect. The amazing Eugene Smith. Good to see Abaddon among the masters. Wow. Well, of course. Lots of people I haven't heard of yet. I that natural movement now. This, this is definitely where cameras go to heaven. Oh man, they have those sweet ultrasonic lenses. And look at that vintage rangefinder. And she loves the cameras. What? what? <laughs> I want that. Oh my god. You always Welcome to the real world. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture of Man, you've got it going on. So do you. Bam! I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that girl. So As I said. She's so fucking shy. Uh, language! Okay, so actually it's my boy then don't don't nod. Don't nod entertainment. That that tune. Damn But this is, it, this is technically in those kind of movies, I gotta say, this kind of tune, but Life is Strange! Episode 1. Chrysalis. That's how you pronounce it, I don't know. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, 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 hey. I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. There's always, there's always one of them in school. Fucking dicks. It looks like she's yeah, I love this tune. Who's that then? Go be missing, you know? Get a drink! Oh no, fine. You just call it a sugar machine. Yeah. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. <laughs> I think you're going a bit off topic here, but you know what, let's have a look around. Don't miss the GM tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. Okay, thank you. That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. My lovely the freaking music. I wonder what actually happened to her. Good thing I left my AK at home. AK? Okay. <laughs> Principal doesn't come out of his office much. Miss Grant. Miss Grant is a great science teacher. I'm sure she is. Okay, we need to go to the uh, toilets. He's Emma. cute. I like skater boys. Too bad they don't like me. You're cute. I wouldn't say he look, I think he looks freaking weird to be honest, but you know what what am I to judge? Uh Samuel is such a weirdo. <laughs> but I kinda like that about him. <laughs> okay. Oh god, here we go. Figures freaking... Juliet would be dating Zachary. Jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. Uh oh, fuck you two and your freaking corniness. People are that I can't fucking like stand. Like they piss me off, I'm not gonna lie. Is that it? This is gonna talk to this guy, Hayden. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro. But he's actually not an ass. Yeah, he doesn't actually look like it. Oh, I can hardly wait to never be too cool like Nathan and Victoria. Yeah. Lame. Fucking music's awesome. I wanna dance. I've got a dance. Oh my god. Okay, this is nice to wrap I'm going a bit too far now. Empty, good. 
Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. You know what? I think that's a good time to end it there. So it seems a bit short for this episode, guys. So I usually do stick to about 20 minutes an episode. I think it's been about 14, 15 minutes now. But I feel like it's a good time to end it. But thanks for watching the first episode of Life is Strange. I hope you enjoyed. I'm looking forward to carrying on with this game. I think I say this literally every, at the start of every single series I do. But screw it. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Give this video a like. Subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys next time.